I'm Danielle Jones Wesley for the Red Carpet Report, and we're at Paley Fest for the fall preview of CBS's new shows, Bob Hart, Abishola, and All Rise. Simone, Danielle, it's good. You know, it's okay. <laughs> all right, we're all good. All right, so you go from you know being a police officer to being the one laying down the gavel. How is that law and order transition? It's a better wardrobe. It's uh, an easier day. Not as many stunts, although I am known to fall on my face, so that requires something. But it's just great to go from one strong female to another strong lead role and and just feel like everyone around me is bringing their best. I've got an amazing cast. I've got just an outstanding team over at CBS and Warner Brothers. You just feel really supported, and that's similar to what you felt with the Marvel fans, so that's great. Yeah. And there's so many great women that you get to work alongside. I mean, what is that like to show the the female aspect of the legal system. It's absolutely amazing. Um, my co-stars are Tony Award winners and just outstanding actresses and women who've been in the business forever. Uh, and there was a, a scene the other day where there are four of us in a room. It's just four women and a female AD and a female director and a female second AD. And we're just like, girls rock. You know, it's wonderful. It's such a blessing. I also saw a really, like right before I came here, I watched your Instagram video where you saw your billboard and it brought a tear to my eye. I, I was really touched by it. I mean, to have that, this 10 year mark and this is where you are, how does that feel? Well, this is actually the 14 year mark, wow. interestingly. Um, it, it, it feels amazing. The 10 years was between being here and landing in LA with hopes and dreams and booking Misty Knight. And then four years later to be on my own billboard and to be the lead of this amazing show. It's it's such a blessing. It's so tremendous. It's overwhelming at times. Uh, but I'm just thankful that there are people who identify with that. I got so many people who are like, yes, I can push on. Their 10-year overnight success is a real thing. And I can, you know, keep living my dream. And they're not even actors. They're just artists and writers. And, you know, people are in grad school. So. And I was seeing, like, so many people, like, so many of our favorite black actors, like, in your comments. Like, Yvonne was like, yeah, girl. Like, uh, no, these are my peoples. And, and what's lovely is, you know, when you go to work, you go to Warner Brothers. I have friends who are working on shows over there. And then you go on Instagram and you have friends that are working on their shows and so it doesn't feel like it's happening in a vacuum it doesn't feel like diversity and inclusion and seeing more women directors and women writers is happening just one place it feels like it's happening everywhere and it's just a great place to be it feels like you're a part of the new harlem renaissance happening in la that's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank Congratulations you so on the show. Much. Like, I literally was like, oh my God, it's so sweet. Thank you. If you liked what you saw tonight, click like, subscribe, and comment below and let us know what you're most excited to watch this fall.